Hi there, I'm James with AIS, and in the video I'm going to show you how to create a shared folder for the Scan to Folder feature on a Mac computer. This is super useful when you have multiple users who need to access those scanned documents within that shared folder. Let's go ahead and jump right in. First, you want to click on the Apple icon and go ahead and click on System Preferences from that menu. In the System Preferences window, you're going to look for an icon that says Sharing. Once you're here, click on the checkbox next to the word File Sharing, which will turn that on for you. The plus sign underneath Shared Folders will allow you to select or create a new shared folder. Then double click on Shared. This will give it at least some of the right permissions. Once you're on that window, click New Folder. Go ahead and type whatever you want to name your folder. In this case, we're just going to call it Scans. Click on the blue Create button. Once that's done, it's technically selected. You can go ahead and click the Add button to finalize that. So we do need to do a quick user add in order to allow the scanner to be able to send files to that folder. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to back up in System Preferences, and we're going to go ahead and click on Users and Groups. You will likely need to unlock this so you can make changes. So be sure to click on the lock, type in your password. The hope is that you're an administrator to this computer. Once that's done, everything that's grayed out is no longer gray. You can click the plus sign here to add a user account. You want to give the account a name. I'm going to call it Kyocera Scanner. Let's make it nice like that because it will fill in just below it with no spaces or capitals. That's the actual username you want to remember a little bit later when this, these credentials are added to the scanner itself. The next item is the password, and you can click on this little key here to create a very strong password. That would be very good for security purposes. If you like that password, go ahead and hit the Enter key and it will fill it in on the screen below you. But be sure and copy this open up my Applications folder, go down to Text Edit, and paste it in there. So I will always have a copy of it somewhere, just in case it leaves my clipboard. So once I'm done here, I can click the red button in the upper left, and the password I have selected, this same password down there on the right, has been created there. No need to add a hint, but you can just create the user. So now that that's completed, we can back out of Users and Groups, go back to Sharing, and now we're going to add that person. Be sure to click Scans first. And then we're going to change the permissions to Read Write. And that's it. You've now created the shared folder for Scan to Folder on your Mac computer. This folder can be accessed by other users on your network, making it super easy to share and manage scared documents. If you have any other questions, feel free to give us a call. Thanks for watching, and remember, you can worry less with AIS.